Hey, what's good, y'all? It's King Z. Now I'm back here on Pit A2 with another mod showcase. I think this is number A. I don't know, some shit like that. But anyways, let's get right into this shit. So the first one I'm going to be showing is the HUD. You know, I try to get at least one HUD and everything. You can see every uh, showcase, but you can see a vanilla HUD. Plus, down here, it was made by Test1. And, um... You can, it is compatible with other uh, HUDs. I, I usually run MUI, as you guys uh, might know, and it's uh, compatible with that. There's like a whole list of shit it's compatible for, but, you know, I didn't want to fuck up anything. I just wanted to get the, the single HUD, not mix it with other HUDs and shit like that. But, yeah, I haven't seen it in game yet. I'm saving that for, so we can get the first reaction from it, you know what I'm saying? But, from the menu that it changes, I really fucking like it you know what i'm saying i'm gonna have to work around with mui and try to get it uh working nice with that but you can see all these uh panel options these vanilla hud extras here got your hud scale your player panel teammate panels i haven't customized these because it's weird to do when you're not in game why would you customize your player panels when you're not in game so yeah we'll just take a look at those when we get in game but you have inventory tweak options. I have real weapon names check show inventory box names. I always show all these things are fucking checked by default. So um, yeah, we got burst mode, sentry auto AP mode, a, a, a whole bunch of shit, man. And uh, I like the um, real weapon names here. You can see it's got all my uh, real weapon names. This is good for people who like know guns by their actual name and not the in-game name. For example, like the 1911 in-game. Uh, that would be the cross kill pistol and I always have fucking trouble remembering that shit for some reason so yeah if you're good with guns you know their names then you know this kind of makes it a little bit easier to find what you're looking for shit like that so yeah I really like it too just looking at their names you know what I'm saying not the you know some of the made up fucking names and shit like that so yeah I really like this HUD from the menu so far uh, we'll have to check it out in game to see how it is but yeah, there's a ton of options. I'm not going to go over all of them because, you know, uh, I got time for that shit. Let me get off the gun because we're not with that shit yet. Yeah, Kiltex Sub 2000. Great name. Um, I can create an empty lobby. That's good. I forgot about that shit. But, um, yeah, let's get into game and show off the heist. I think I accidentally said let's show off the heist instead of HUD. So, you know, don't mind that shit. I'm a little bit of a fucking retard, as you guys might know. But, yeah, let's get in game and show this off. And uh, later on, I think I'm going to keep this shit installed. Not many HUDs um, mess with like the main menu and shit like that. But yeah, I can already tell my um, player panel is a little bit different. It shows accuracy, kill counter. There was like fucking 50 other mods that like are built into this shit. You can see uh, timers on there, timer in the top left. And all this shit, you can tweak and shit like that. So yeah, timers to deploy shit, all that. Uh, you can see if we go to... Oh, I'm not retarded, can't find it. Uh, mod options. Okay, here. You can change all your, like, text shit, all that. Uh, the timer in the top uh, where it shows that shit. Crew loadout options. You got the inventory shit again. You can uh, choose to skip the black, black screen on mission starts, instant restart, so you don't gotta wait that five seconds out. Stat screen speed up, which is really fucking nice. Uh, auto pick cards. I just have mine to the center because I always pick the uh, center. You know what I'm saying? That's just what I do. Just go in there, hit that shit. Got tab stats options here. You know what I'm saying? Has the clock right there. It says 2003. It should be 803. Let me check the phone. All right, my phone wasn't by me, but um, you know, I checked my computer. It is in fact 803. So that shows the real time right there. So you don't gotta like tab out or nothing like that. Uh, you can change the colors right there. It's just set to rainbow by default. So you know, it's a bit of a fucking rainbow, but yeah, it shows a ton of shit. I really fuck with this. I'm like, I'm gonna have to keep this shit installed. I usually uninstall HUDs because I just fuck with MUI, but this one I think has gotta stay, man. I think it's gotta stay. So, um, yeah, that is Vanilla HUD by Test1. Like I said, all the links to these shits will be in the description. And let's move on to the next mod. All right, up next here, we have FedNet. This is a gameplay mod by Sergeant Joe. And from what I read on it, um, it's basically, I have still have my custom shits right there. But, yeah, if I buy, yeah, sure right here, you can see there's, like, different heists. And for these you play as um the police and you're there to stop um shit so 
yeah you can see there's like different things right here there's different factions and shit there's 26 new police officer textures new heights and shit so um yeah i never played this shit yet we're gonna see how it is i think we're gonna go to a bank robbery sounds fun got some voices right there let's get it man buy a contract let's see what's happening we'll use you know, we'll just use our good old... That's another thing about this HUD, too. Like, it shows, like, your loadout, which I fucking love, bro. This shit... Man, shout out to Test1 for this HUD, bro. This shit is nice as fuck, man. But, yeah. Let's get into this shit. See what's happening. All right, we're in here. We can see bank robbery. Armed robbers are reportedly attempting to breach a bank located in an office building downtown. Officers require the scene. Stop the suspects from opening the vault. Now, we have assets here. I like those. Custom assets. Yes, sir. Um... Oh, and it also gives you, uh, like, a default loadout, and it depends on the difficulty, too. So the higher the difficulty, the better the loadout you're going to have. I don't know how skills and shit work, honestly, but, um, you know, I guess we'll find out. We're running a Kimbo a Glocks. I guess <laughs> triple Glock. We have a fucking baton, two-piece suit. Uh, let's get it, man. I really fuck with this shit. Let's go. There, glass breaking and shit. I don't know if I'm going to play through the whole thing. At least I'm not going to show the whole thing. It looks like we are a custom police officer. Yes, we are. I'm, yes, sir. Let's go, man. Shout out to Sergeant Joe. This shit is crazy. Yeah, I'm... Oh, shit. Well, I tried to shoot and I crashed. I don't know if that's uh because of one of my mods, but... Yeah, I'll, I'll, no, I'll start it back up. I'll try one more time. If it don't work with, uh, you know, I got so much shit installed. I'm I'm assuming the, the mod itself is fine, but I got so much shit installed. It's probably interfering with some shit. So, yeah, I'll try one more and see how that shit goes. All right, so this one, you can see I did armed robbery. I changed the difficulty to overkill just to, like, kind of show the load out here. So, you know, we have a car four here. Uh, I forgot. I don't know what the fucking real name is for this shit. That's why I have the fucking, you know, that's why I like the real names. Uh, I think it's the Chimano. Should be a Chimano. I don't know. Glock. Knife. Heavy ballistic vest. Concussion grenade. Uh, I'll rebuy the assets. I'm gonna try not to shoot until I have to, just to kind of run around and show y'all what's happening and shit. And yeah, you can see difficulty. Change the loadout. I like that shit. Uh, police are on our... Oh, that's our team. Okay. Yeah, I, re I really don't want to fucking shoot. Oh, we have actual cops on our team, too. I like that shit. I like that shit. The lag spike right there. It's all good, though. Go up and shank this motherfucker. Oh, shit. I'm using uh, stoic. And I can't use my shit. Okay, so I can shoot. Now, I don't know what the problem was last time, but... You know, I probably should have uh, changed builds. Because I'm using stoic. And I don't have the fucking flask. So, you know, that that's tough. Bro, this is a fucking robber? What the fuck? But yeah, there's waves and shit here. You can see all that. Oh my god. We have damage indicators from the HUD. But, yeah, I think you guys get the idea. I'm gonna turn this shit down. <laughs> okay, that was loud as fuck in my ear. I didn't know if y'all could hear me, but... Yeah, you can see. I think you guys get the idea of what's happening here. We have bags remaining there. There's people up there. Holy shit, this is crazy as fuck. But, yeah, I really like this mod. I think I'll do a, like a stream or some shit with this later. Shout out to Sergeant, Sergeant Joe, man. Sorry, I got the fucking hiccups. I got like, be drinking that Mountain Dew and shit, you know what I'm saying? It'd be getting to me, you know? But, yeah. Custom models, I think, are nice as fuck. Uh, we have a game mode where we can play as police, which I think should have been in the game. That's what Payday Crime War was, but who knows what the fuck happened to that shit. We have like, doors and shit opened up that's nice you know just just a really fucking good mod fun mod if you're looking for something different man uh but yeah i think that's enough of this and we will get into the next mod all right so up next here uh is the barrett m107 cq made by i don't know how the fuck he wants me to say his name it's like a face you know it'll be on the screen um I don't know how he wants me to say that, but, you know, shout out to him. I've shown his guns before, and, you know, I just, I love me some custom fucking guns, man. They're my most downloaded shits. I download more guns than any other fucking mod. I have a ton of them. I love downloading them. I like using them, and I like people who make them right, and he makes them right, you know what I'm saying? So, we have the Barrett M107 CQ here. Um, 
as you can see if I modify a weapon uh, custom colors and skins do work on here so you know you can change to whatever you want on here use whatever uh, skin you have I haven't bought the DLC yet just because I don't ever add fucking money to my Steam account but yeah this should work with um, paint mode too if you have that uh, weapon painter mod I'm pretty sure that's what it's called but yeah we have uh, 416 Barrett conversion kit gives you more ammo takes off 1700 fucking damage and ammo pickup is not modified with this ammunition it can be increased with skills or perks uh, I decided not to put that on uh, I put this custom suppressor on uh, also has a long barrel if you're into that and I love the fucking Barrett muzzle break it's just some shit to be fucking reckoned with man but you know I wanted to go with the suppressor just kind of a kind of a nod towards the next build I plan on doing even though it probably won't come up for a while because there, I don't want to use this gun but if I have to you know I guess that's gonna be it but I also need a ghillie suit so you know it's gonna give you some Call of Duty 4 vibes I ain't gonna spoil it but you could probably guess what I'm trying to do I just don't have the correct weapon for that specific mission if you get what I'm saying so yeah anybody who knows how to make guns please hit me up because I have some shit that needs to be made. At least, you know, teach me the ways to do this shit. Because I got some shit I need. I threw the bipod on there. Again, because you used a bipod in that specific mission. Well, not the mission I was going for. But the one after that. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. We have a carry handle right there. It just gives it that Barrett look. You know what I'm saying? Gotta have the carry handle on that shit. No gadget. Because fuck that. Contractor grip. And didn't change the sight on it. So, you know let's get in game and shoot some shit with it all right we have our barret here it only holds the 10 rounds in here so let's plop down a fucking ammo bag well that works too okay you there's no extra ammo with this shit but it does do 2444 damage at least with the setup i got and i don't know if there's ammo pickup but like he said you can increase ammo with skills and shit like that but yeah i'm gonna have to fuck with this hud because i don't like that dodge indicator right there but anyways let's just spawn some shit in we got 10 shots let's do a zeal swat heavy he's got 960 health that this should you know fuck him up right away uh you know we'll do a zeal cloaker 3.6 thousand health now he's got zero god i love this fucking reload man okay this is, I like this fucking gun. I like this shit. Uh, I guess we'll start off with a normal bulldozer. 24,000 H. Hey, bitch. Knock this plate off, bitch. Okay. That's crazy. That is crazy. Let's do a zeal bulldozer. Yeah, I should probably use this to knock his uh, face shield off. Is it off? No. Alright, so he has 23,000 HP, and he has 516 left. Now we'll just finish. Nah, we'll, we'll hit him with the bear in the face, man. We'll hit him. Yeah, this shit is strong. I see why the ammo is, uh, you know, not the best on it, but, you know, we're waiting for the mini gun dozer. Let's get it. 48,000 HP. See how many shots it takes for the bear to take him down. And yeah, we can't mark him for the extra crit. If he'd stop fucking moving, that'd be great. Alright, 42,000 health. Boom. And... Okay, if I shot him directly in the face, then, you know, four shots to kill him. Uh, let's let's restock on some ammo real quick. I want to get all the shots straight to his face and see how it does. And then we will move on to the next weapon here. So boom, boom, boom. Motherfucker. I know it's impressive, bitch, ain't it? All right, get that good shot in. What the fuck happened there? Okay, so around four shots to kill a minigun dozer on Death Sentence difficulty. That shit is crazy. Let's try Phalanx. Okay, this this gun is pretty fucking strong, as you can she see. So I can, you know I can't speak. Uh, so you know, shout out to shout out to dude. You know, if you if you wanna you know do me a favor, hit me up and uh you know I got another custom sniper that I would like to have made. So yeah, let's move on to the next weapon. So up next here, we have the Triton MFG TR-15. I bought two of them here, you can see all the shit you could put on it by the <laughs> way it loads. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it is 
customizable using a weapon painter if you're into that shit i just threw some uh random shit on got this gold orange white skin going you know really nice also compatible with uh custom uh skins so if you have those throw them bitches on there uh on here i just threw some of the mods on that i have the default one i can show you guys the iron sights look really fucking clean on here so yeah we have the stainless spiral spiral fluted 223 wild bear you can see the barrel kind of spirals in there you can't really see it because the handguards in the way but yeah i really like this thing because of the amount of like customizations on things you know what i'm saying like he knows his shit and you see that more in the um when you go to if it goes paint mode here you see he's got like barrel the buffer tube like the bolt charger handle dust cover that's how you know when motherfuckers know they shit and that's why i like the, he has the fucking gas block like shit's nice a lot of guns uh customizations don't have these so yeah we got the stock adapter trigger all the shit you know what i'm saying so leon this is made by leon s shout out to him he knows his shit i like that but yeah uh it's got custom some custom uh attachments here we have this heartbreaker muzzle brake right there i was using the raptor muzzle brake just you know looks cool sounds cool uh, put this custom charging handle on there timber creek enforcer and the charging handle here goes the default one so yeah this one's just a little bit bigger looks a little more i don't know kind of looks like a fucking bat <laughs> uh you got that shit i put this uh, military laser module on there just because i could i threw on a ergo grip uh Depending on the grip it had, it like changed up the skin a little bit. That's what it looked like by default. But I put the Hyperion skin. It's a Scar skin. I don't know what the fucking gun's called. I think Eagle Heavy skin. And uh, yeah, I had to put the Ergo grip on there and then uh, change the foregrip up. So yeah, I was going for looks on this one. Do the L5 mag on there. Uh, he's got its own lower receiver. I didn't like the way this looked or I think it changed something. Never mind. I don't know. Not much of a difference, to be honest. But, you know, if there is, I don't know, maybe I'm looking at the wrong side. That would, that would make sense. I was probably looking at the wrong fucking side the whole time. Yes, I was. Okay. I was like, there's no fucking difference. I was looking at the wrong goddamn side. But, yeah, low receiver. You got the sight on there. I just went with the military red dot sight. Uh, there is, never mind. I thought there was something else. Uh, you got some stocks here. You got this custom stock. I didn't like the way it looked like it's the it's the skin i was using i know that but yeah i didn't want the red i think it's the skin i'm using but yeah i didn't like the red so i went back to the i don't even know what the fuck i was using contractor stock fuck it we'll go with it uh and then you got a butt pad here which is not compatible with my mods so yeah here goes the default one this is a really fucking clean looking gun i ain't gonna lie to you so yeah take a look at the default there i think this would look better if i customize to the customer there you can see it better but yeah the trident mfg tr15 very good looking rifle so you know let's get into game and shoot some shit all right here it is our triton my laser is the wrong color but you know whatever uh we'll start off simple you know what i'm saying just normal swat 480 hp Two shots to the head. He is gone. Let's put the shit on single fire so I'm not missing shots. Shield. Does it have penetration? Probably not. No. Why would it? Yeah. Uh, let's go for a taser. Zeal taser. You know, not the most damage, but I love the way it looks, man. I don't know if it's competing with the... Four oh, shit. With the uh, HK416. That's made by the dude who made the... Um, uh, Barrett, I'm pretty sure, so... Yeah, I don't know if it's competing with the 4.6 team, but, you know, I like, the, I like it, man. It's a very clean-looking gun. Let's uh, see if we can mag dump into this bulldozer. Oh, got burst on. Whoops. All right. Yeah, definitely not the most uh, damaging AR, but, man, does it look good. And that's all that fucking matters to me, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let's get a... Zeal bulldozer, and then we'll do a minigun bulldozer, and then get into the custom heist. My KHP left. Dump into his head. There we go. Minigun dozer time. Let's see it. Fresh shield off, doing 65.6 .6 damage per shot by the looks of it. 
So yeah, definitely not too much damage on here. But yeah, I like this gun nonetheless. Uh, looks really nice. Feels very nice, you know what I'm saying? It's got the, you know, I just like all the, I, I like customizing guns, man. I could spend like hours customizing guns on here. But um, yeah, really nice gun. Shout out. Really nice gun. Shout out to Leon S. Link in the description to this shit. And let's move on to the final mod, which as always is a custom heist. All right, up next here, we have Zombie House. Yes, another Zombies map. Hopefully I don't crash. Last time I played, uh, I tried to play Kino and I tried to hit a zombie. I tried to melee a zombie and I crashed. So yeah, hopefully that don't happen here. It shouldn't. It's two different creators. This one, I'm get, I'm a, it's not the creator's fault. It's my fault. I got so much shit installed, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, this house or this uh, map was made by Capcake. Shout out to him. Uh, so, yeah, let's see what he's working with here. Let's not let's not go too too hard on the difficulty. You know what I'm saying? Hard mode will do I. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, zombie house. Let's get it, man. And I do want to do a zombie stream eventually. I just ain't really got to it. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Make sure you got them notifications on and shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, I fucking crashed. Let's uninstall some mods and see if we can get this shit going, man. Alright y'all, I could not get that map to stop crashing, man. I uninstalled some mods and shit, you know what I'm saying? I didn't want to uninstall too much shit, because, you know, I don't want to break other mods that I got and shit like that. But, yeah, I just could not get the shit to load up. It kept fucking crashing, so, yeah. I'm assuming if you ain't got as much shit going on in your game as me, it should work just fine. So, sorry, I can't show nothing on that, but, you know... Shout out to Capcake, man. I know he working on a big-ass motherfucking project. So, hopefully, when that gets done, I can showcase that shit soon. That's going to be his whole separate motherfucking video and shit like that. But, you know, shout out to him. Um, All the links to all the mods will be in the description below. Make sure you pay attention when downloading some mods. Because some, like, especially guns, require other shit to be installed for them to work. So, yeah, it's a, you know simple process but you know make sure you pay attention to the description of shit so yeah that's basically it for this video i got more shit coming more bills more videos more custom shit all that shit you know what i'm saying more streams and shit you know what i'm saying so make sure you subscribe turn the motherfucking not notifications on you know what i'm saying give a like if you enjoyed hit that sub button if you're new to the channel for more dumbass shit like this you know what i'm saying and uh yeah i'll see y'all in the next video